All right, what you're gonna have to do to get these is to actually remove the battery, remove the battery box. Trust me, if you need information on how to do that, you're talking to the wrong guy or a little bit advanced beyond that. So I'm just trying to get to the point here. Uh, and what you're gonna do is below that battery box and that battery, below the main fuse block here, you will find those pass-through wires. On earlier trucks, they were up here in the main harness. Uh, that is not the case on the 21. They are down underneath, and you have to remove the battery box to get to those. Uh, just real quick, I knew where they were on the inside of the cab, but uh, for your information, on the inside of the cab, on the inside of the cab, they are behind the passenger side uh, kick panel there. Uh, been real nice if Ford would have included them in that harness, but that's not the case. They are actually way up above, way up inside here. Sorry, trying to get in here. Up above everything, I had to use a pick to get them out of there, but there they are. Okay, that's where you find them on the inside. And that's where you find them on the outside. That's just the pass-through wires. This right here is your uh, upfitter switch relays and fuses. Um, that's real easy. Down underneath there, there's lots and lots of videos on that. I'm not going to tell you all about that, but that's all the uh, uh, wires that Ford puts in when you get the upfitter switch package. All right. Again, John with Hillbilly Wizard uh, out here working on this 450. <clears throat> Hope you're having a good day. Thank you.